Located on the eastern Indochina Peninsula, Vietnam has been valued as the country of strategic position in the region and considered as an important gate connecting with ASEAN countries and the rest of the world. Thanks to comprehensive system of roads, waterways and allies, particularly a network of deep water ports spreading along the north, center and south of the country, which allows receiving cruise ships and large tonnage vessels, is an outstandingly favorable condition for economic development, especially the development of logistic system in sea transportation to integrate with Asian nations and the world. Vietnam's accession to WTO in early 2007 has paved the way for greater market liberalization and such waves of foreign investment into Vietnam. From 2007 to 2012, the total amount of new and registered FDI increased to 138.5 billion US dollars, among which processing industry and manufacturing attracted the largest portion of approximately 60%. A significant contributor to economic development in recent years is the Ministry of Industry and Trade of Vietnam, a governmental office which performs the state management on industry and trade. Industry The function of state management of the Ministry of Industry and Trade is displayed on principal branches and sectors such as petroleum, mechanism, Metallurgy, Electricity, New Energy, Renewable Energy, Chemistry, Mines Exploiting, Minerals Processing, Consuming Industry, Food Industry, and Other Processing Sectors. Trade Activities On the Domestic Market So far, Vietnam has operated a network of 900 supermarkets and department stores and approximately 9,000 wholesale centers wholesale market and retail market of different types. Export market has expanded to over 230 countries and territories. Human resources In the domain of science, technology and human resource training, the Ministry of Industry and Trade with more than 50 vocational schools of different levels, 20 intensive and multidisciplinary research institutes provides annually thousands of high-quality workers for national economic sectors. Integration During the last period, international integration activities have been comprehensively implemented in many fields. The Ministry of Industry and Trade of Vietnam has led and carried out successfully all activities on international integration from WTO, ASEAN, APEC, to ASEAN, as well as bilateral FTA negotiations with EU, Japan, Chile. ASEAN-China Comprehensive Economic Cooperation, or ACFTA, ASEAN-Korea FTA, ASEAN-India Trade in Goods Agreement, ASEAN-Australia New Zealand Free Trade Agreement. Development Orientation for Vietnam's Industry and Trade to 2020 and Vision to 2030. Industry Concentrate on promoting the development of prioritized industrial sectors such as mechanics and metallurgy, including machines and equipment used for every country, shipbuilding, automobile, mechanical devices, and spare parts and skill. Electronic and information, equipment for telecommunication, electronic components, energy, oil and gas offshore exploring and exploiting petrochemical, nuclear power, and other renewable energy. Chemistry, plastic, rubber, pharmaceutics, and other sectors, every country, forestry, elementary products, as well as other goods for consumption. Also concentrating on the development of supporting industry to these sectors. Trade. Build up a network of supermarkets and department stores in Vietnam to become a main retail channel on the domestic market. Institutionalize Vietnam's commitment within the World Trade Organization or WTO on opening markets in goods and distribution services. Promote import export activities in the direction of both expanding market and enhancing export import efficiency. Continue expanding trade by signing bilateral and multilateral free trade agreements to promote goods exportation. 
Today, Vietnam is rising on the path to the international integration as the members of WTO, participating in many free trade zones and having economic and trading ties with almost all countries and territories in the world. Vietnam shows a wish to cooperate in investment and develop with every partner in the world on the basis of mutual benefits. These are remarkable milestones lifting the integration of Vietnam to the global level.